Hi everyone, my name is Sierra and welcome to Totally Teens Tuesday. Now I am here to talk to you about my favorite Black African American authors. By the time you see this video, Black History Month may be over, but we celebrate and honor our Black African American authors all year long. Let's get into it. Starting off with Justin A. Reynolds. He is the author of Opposite of Always, and I absolutely love this novel. This book will leave you full of bowls of cereal, laughter, and an amazing love story. It features Jack, who is in a pretty weird and confusing time loop as he tries to save his dying girlfriend, Kate. You should get into it. Now up next is Carolee Corthoran, author of Daughters of Jubilation. In this historical fiction novel, you'll discover Evie as she goes on a path to learning about all of her new magical abilities that have been passed down from her ancestors in slavery time. As something lurks in the shadows, Evie's powers grow stronger and you'll find out what happens next. And coming up third is Lamar Giles, author of Not So Pure and Simple. This funny, realistic fiction novel is about a boy who falls for a girl ever since they were in grade school. And yet this is full of twists, turns as relationships are tested and friendships are put on the line. Read this book to get all the feels and all the tea. Now let's dig into Oweke Umizi, Arthur of Pets. In this thrilling fantasy novel, the main character Jam grows up in a loving and accepting home in a utopian world that is no longer filled with monsters, or so she believes. After accidentally dropping blood on one of her mother's paintings, Jam not only discovers a new creature, but finds out the truth in her perfectly unperfect world. Read this novel to tackle on the theme of good versus evil and monsters versus angels as Jam quickly and quietly unpacks her world. Now let's talk about Namina Forna. Her debut novel, The Gilded Ones, is a West African-inspired fantasy novel featuring main character 16-year-old Dekka. After De Dekka wakes up from a near-death experience, realizing that her blood runs gold, a mysterious woman takes her to a village filled of girls just like her. The Alakai are immortals with rare gifts who are also seeking to overthrow the emperor. Find out what happens to the patriarchy in this novel and how Decca's world gets turned upside down. And thank you so much for tuning in with me today. Here are some more Black African American authors you may have seen floating around on social media, sitting on our bookshelves, or in one of your neighbor's or best friend's hands. These books are were printed in the last decade or so, and they are so much fun to read. You will find a YA novel for anyone enjoying mysteries, contemporary novels, sci-fi and fantasy, memoirs, LGBTQ books, and romance and more. <laughs> now, I hope you enjoyed my small list of my favorite Black African American authors. You can find the full list at DermCountyLibrary.org, or you can just look in our catalog via Libby or Overdrive, and you will see all the amazing authors we have from fantasy to mystery and thriller and short stories. There's a few graphic novels in there. Believe me, there's something for everyone. Happy reading, and we'll see you next week.